Hello YouTube, welcome back to another Windows 8 tutorial. So this tutorial is going to be based on preventing Windows 8 File Explorer from deleting an image thumbnail cache. Now these thumbnail cache have to do with, let's say for instance, a PDF file, a Word file, an image file, and a video file, and etc. Now these particular files, they have thumbnails on them to represent what they are, possibly the cover, or a slight preview of it. Now if you like your thumbnail cache, and you don't want them deleted, whether it be a maintenance tool or the operating system itself, which would be the File Explorer extension, I'm going to show you how to prevent Files Explorer from deleting it. Now, first off, what you want to do is you want to make sure that you're logged onto the Windows from an administrative account or have a required administrative rights to change the system user's special permissions. Now, the next thing that you will be doing is with your keyboard on the desktop workspace, when you want to press the Windows key, then R for run. And with the highlighted area that I have already, you want to press the shift and press the percentage sign, then type in user profile, and then again, shift percentage sign as well. Once you have that inputted, you want to press OK. This will come up. And once this comes up, we want to go ahead and navigate to the View tab to unhide a particular file that we need to get access to. So in the Options area, we want to click on the Folder Options View tab. And right here, the Show Hidden Files, Folders, and Drives, we want to go ahead and show them. Once that's checked, we want to press Apply and then press OK. Now this folder app data is revealed now. We want to go into that. We want to go also into the local folder and within the Microsoft folder and then down to the Windows folder. Now in this folder, we want to right click on Explore or select it first, then right click, go down to the Properties tab. Since you want to go ahead and change the file access permissions, head over to the Security tab. Now click on Advance which is presented underneath the Permissions table. Now once that's open, this is going to go ahead and open the advanced security settings for Explorer. Unlike previous Windows versions, Windows 8 doesn't allow you to go ahead and edit the system principle, which is the virtual user file permissions. But you can add a new principle and choose to inherit its permission to other principles in the list. In order to add a new principle and set its file access permissions, you want to click Add. Once under Add, it's going to go ahead and open the Permission Entry for Explorer dialog box. Now select the Select a Principle. Once that comes up, the Select User or Group will come up. When we come over here, you're going to want to manually input System, which can be spelt S-Y-S-T-E-M in all caps. We will check names. Once that name is checked, it'll be underlined and approved. We can press OK. Once that's set, this will go ahead and add a system principle. Now you can deny, which is under here, under the type, and under the subfolders and files from the type, you wanna leave this alone. After that, we wanna to go to the advanced permissions link, and once this is uh, viewable, we wanna check mark delete, delete subfolders and files, and then uncheck everything else. Now, once that's all check marked, we wanna press the OK. Upon clicking, it's going to add an automatic new permission entry, which you can see right here, and it's under Special. Click Apply to set the new permissions for the system folder. And before you close the Advanced Security Settings window, navigate to the Effective Access tab, which is right here. And just to confirm, we want to go ahead and select a user. We want to input System, check the names, press OK. And then we want to view the Effective Access. This will show what we have, and most of it is checked. We have delete and whatnot. So this means that the file explorer is not going to be able to delete it. We want to press OK. We also want to press OK here. In case it doesn't restrict the delete permissions, log off to Windows, log in again as administrator, and follow the above mentioned steps in this video. When the delete permissions from the explorer folder are revoked, it will stop deleting your image thumbnail database files. Make sure you guys know that the Windows Disk Cleanup Utility will not be able to delete it regardless if it's checked or not. So unless you go ahead and reinstate Explorer's folder full control, you have nothing to worry about and you can manage your thumbnail cache files by yourself. So that concludes our video for the preventing File Explorer from deleting the thumbnail cache itself. 
and allowing you fuller control to lead them manually yourself. Until next time, see you later, guys.